At 6, a state report is giving the Sausalito School District a failing grade. It claims key funds are being funneled away from a mostly black public school straight into a charter school. Reporter Kristen Ayers with a story you'll see only on 5. Welcome to Sausalito, ladies and gentlemen. Sausalito, world famous for its spectacular location and beauty. But behind the scenes, a battle is brewing that some say tarnishes that fairy tale picture. It's a tale of two schools, one in the exclusive and mostly white hillside neighborhood that overlooks the waterfront, the other in Marin City, the historically black and poorer side of town on the other side of the freeway. I don't think there's favoritism going on. Kurt Weinsheimer has three children attending Willow Creek Academy, the district's K through eight charter school, and sits on its board of directors. It's a pretty magical place. Um, that we're really passionate about. There's an emphasis on a rounded education, art, music, and academic achievement. But it's a completely different story here at the district's public school, Bayside Martin Luther King Jr. Almost all of the kids who go to school here are from disadvantaged black families in the neighborhood. Unlike Willow Creek, we were not invited in. District officials would not allow us to talk to anyone inside. But according to district data, there have been major funding cuts. There's no more art teacher, no more music teacher, not even a full-time gym teacher. Even credentialed teaching positions in math and science have been cut this year. As a result, test scores have plummeted. Zero percent of students tested at grade level in seventh and eighth grade at Bayside MLK in the 2014-15 school year. It's criminal <laughs> um, to have a school have those kinds of of performance outcomes. Betty Hodges runs an after school study program for the Bayside MLK kids. She says she gets middle schoolers who can barely read or write. Yet when she brought the test scores to the attention of the Sausalito Marin City School Board, one of the trustees said, We've never seen this data before. And I'm like, how is that possible? Along with others in her community, she complained to the Marin County Board of Education and Superintendent Mary Jane Burke. It's totally unacceptable, and we know that that's totally unacceptable. And so what we have to do is look at what's going on, you know, what, what is happening. So Burke commissioned a state education task force to write a report that just came out this month. It concludes the Sausalito Marin City School District diverts money and resources, possibly as much as $1.9 million this school year alone, to Willow Creek. And that's at the expense of the mostly minority, low-income children at Bayside MLK. There is money available, but it is currently being provided to the independent charter school rather than caring first for these children. The district superintendent originally declined to talk to us. Then he agreed to an interview here before canceling it just a few hours ago. Instead, he sent us a statement acknowledging that the report raises questions and concerns and saying he plans to create some sort of action plan. But at Willow Creek, they had plenty to say. It is shocking um, that, first of all, you would have a report that would get so many facts wrong. Weinsheimer says more money is going to Willow Creek because there are more than twice as many students. As for painting the two schools as white versus black. I would argue we're got to be one of the most, if not the most, diverse school. That doesn't satisfy County Superintendent Burke, who says she's asked the state to intervene. There is a deep-seated feeling that there is um, segregation happening uh, in this community. It does need to change, and it needs to change immediately. And another twist to that story, many of the kids that go to Willow Creek come from other cities because it's seen as such a good school. But critics point out that's just one more way Sausalito taxpayer money that is supposed to benefit Sausalito kids is being misspent. Kristen Ayers, KPIX 5.